welcome back to another episode of Hello Betu. My name is Tehrani Rebecca from the Department of Linguistics. She is Alopo from the Department of Moscow. And we are so excited to have Lima in this episode. For today's episode, we're going to talk about the course that Lima is taking and the activities that this department is uh, indulging. It's very exciting because it's something that a lot of us, you know, like including yeah. myself, are like, it's so easy to repeat something before. Exactly. So. Mm-hmm. I'll just, you know, give the time to Lima to introduce himself. So hi everyone, uh, my name is Lima from Base of the Department, first semester. Um, first of all, I would really like to extend my gratitude towards the team, the podcasting team, uh, on camera and off camera as well. And I'm really excited for t- today's episode and mm-hmm. looking forward for an interesting uh, podcast episode. You're so welcome in uh, here and you don't have to feel pressured. Please be comfortable. We are, it's very unprofessional, so you can be very casual here. Yes, you, you, you can even, we can even remove the trouble and allow you to sit on the ground. <laughs> yeah, if you will. That's yeah. comfortable for if, you. If that's, how, if, if, if that's how the social workers, like yeah. the social work department feel comfortable. <laughs> so, so yeah. diving into your courses, mm-hmm. like what kind of topics do you do the subject and they Like social work is a very new subject mm-hmm. here. Mm-hmm. So what do you guys do? And I was also informed that uh, the department students are go and visit places every Friday to have practical experiences. Yeah. So like, do you guys visit different places every Friday? And do you guys go in groups or individually? Okay, so uh, I'll first answer your first question that was okay. uh, what kind of topics yeah. we, we study on. Uh, so as so, uh, at social work subject is a very uh, vast subject, I would say. We don't specifically focus on one subject, one topic, but we also focus on different uh, areas, such as science, we study uh, uh, English as well. So it's, okay. it's a mixture of every uh, various uh, subjects, I would say. And then uh, the, your second question that was uh, we visit organizations. Yes. Yeah. So till second semester, we we have been visiting uh, different organizations, mm, and then uh, it was in groups okay. guided by our professors. Mm. So there, uh, we every Friday, yes, we go to different organizations. We conduct uh, an orientation with them about the organization, and if time a lot and if they allow they allow we uh, we do uh, help them in their works uh, we uh, do some activities that might be helpful for our report writing okay yeah. that's great it is very interesting i mean you must see i don't mean to, i don't mean i don't mean to come rude or I'm sorry if i offend you with this question but when people say bachelors of social work yeah. i'm like the typi- is it about the typical social work we do every Saturday? Yeah. Because that's how we grew up. Yeah, right? yes. We have social work on Saturday and meet <laughs> and we're like, oh, we're going to go out the ground again. Yeah. Yes, yes, yes. So is it like related with like, you know, like volunteering mm-hmm. works, the NGOs? Well, uh, frankly speaking, that's like the social stigma that has been mm-hmm. on our heads, on our minds mm-hmm. since the, uh, like how we grow up. Yeah. Grew up. So, I would like to clear that. Uh, is of course social work is about uh, laborious working, mm-hmm. volunteerism, where we volunteer ourselves to work for the society, like clean stuff and, and whatnot. Mm-hmm. But it has more to it, mm-hmm. as in uh, we also uh, how do I say it? Uh, help those who are in need. Not only uh, cleaning the areas, cleaning yeah. the ground and stuff, but like uh, it's more than just. More working. than just working, yeah, I would say. So, what's your favorite place? Like, you guys have been to so many places, I presume. Yes, yes. So, what's your favorite place so far? Well, till uh, the previous semester, we had we had visited this old age home. It's located in Jumu, and mm. it's uh, for, for me personally, it was very insightful. Okay. Yeah. So, there was one thing that I like truly. Uh, personally, truly, uh, was inspired. That's nice. Even I love old people. You know, I'm not a romantic or anything, but <laughs> but something about them and yeah. the kids, like I, I think we I learned a lot from them. Yes, the, the, the witty thing, one is like 
they're very pure they have not experienced life yet yeah. they have a different way of thinking mm-hmm. whereas like for the old, uh, old age people they are like way experienced in they have so yeah. much wisdom yes, yes. they have so much wisdom so much experiences yeah. oh. mm-hmm. that's nice it's really nice and like uh, how would you like describe your course if we are to ask with professionally as an academic okay. So uh, yeah, so social work is a practice-based subject where uh, we help people to help themselves. Oh. So that's okay. briefly what how I would uh, uh, describe okay. my. Course. And how much would you rate a PSW from one to ten? I think ten on ten. <laughs> <laughs> because because it's really fun to be honest. It's really fun uh, for someone who is like socially very active. Mm. I'm someone who is socially very active in society. So mm. for me, it's uh, practical, uh, practically and as well theoretically fun. Yeah. Okay. Speaking of being, you know, like socially active, uh, we heard about your singing career. You know, like uh. the hobby that you have. So like, can you uh, tell us more about it? Well. Uh, it's more than a hobby. It is a passion. Like, like I really, really love to sing, and I've been uh, well recently. Our college had this uh, music concert mm-hmm. where the uh, choir Bright Lights mm-hmm. was also a part of the concert. So I was also a member of the Bright Lights for two oh, years. Really? Yeah. So I was also a member of the Bright Lights for two years, and then that was where my uh, journey of a, as a musician began. Okay. So, so, uh, do you uh, cover or do you also compose your originals? Well, I do cover mostly. Okay. And originals as of now, uh, it's not been on the spotlight yet. Okay. So, yeah. But you do it, right? Yeah, I do it. Yeah. Mm-hmm. So, uh, when are you planning to share your originals with us? Not, are, not any sooner. <laughs> Yeah. Not any sooner, not any Come sooner. with to yeah. launch. <laughs> but you promised to. Yeah, okay, sure. I, I promise, I promise. Let's go first. <laughs> <laughs> we Call actually. Pretty good. Yeah, that's it. Yeah. Listening. But it's really. Mm. It's very exciting because, like, uh, there are a lot of um, many talented students, not yeah. just teachers, yes, indeed, but. Yeah. You know, the community itself mm-hmm. is really separating. Mm-hmm. Not just this uh, Miss World or this this pageantry, but then you know, like a lot of musicians, a lot of uh, startup owners, a lot of business uh, businessmen, also yeah. business, and even the ladies. It's very surprising because a lot of girls. Uh, there is there is one senior of ours who owns a food truck. Wow. So runs a food truck and then wow. yeah. that's so like, cool, no? We're a collection of um, people with so many talents mm-hmm. and the fact that the college is honing our talents instead of just <laughs> shunning us away, mm-hmm. I think that's a really um, empowering for the youths in Nagaland, no? For real. Because like when you bring your academics and your uh, hobbies, you know, like wanting your hobbies to yeah. turn into a patient but because of lack of opportunities. Mm-hmm. You you know like tend to leave your patient in science. Yes. Yeah. But I would say like if you're a student and you have a patient in something, you should always make sure that you're balancing your patient and your mm-hmm. academic. Yes, yes. Like sure. it's not just that like just because there's no opportunities you give up trying. You have sometimes you have to make your own opportunities. Yeah. Mm-hmm. And I love how uh the youths now they're recognizing that Having talents is so important, mm-hmm. and we are opting for our talents and going forward with our passions instead mm-hmm. of just going for white collar jobs. Mm-hmm. Now I think our mindsets are also slowly changing, and that's so beautiful yeah. about it. Exactly. And it's the thing I'm curious about Ling is like you're interested in the singing career, but then your course is something else. Like it's like BSW. Yeah, what do you yeah, like, like music? Yeah, I'm curious about it. Okay, uh, speaking about uh, BSW first, mm-hmm. the social work, it it does not only focuses uh, like uh, like I've uh, mentioned earlier. It's yeah. not, it does not focuses only on specific uh, field, but it's like it's it emphasizes on different various fields. So, being a musician also comes under the social work. So okay. like through social work, I can. Like uh, give uh, music classes, or I can uh, oh, conduct, yeah. conduct concerts, like fundraising concerts as well. I so think, that's part of a society mm, work, right? So I think that's, that's a very broad thinking, yeah, yeah. and yeah. that's a very good choice. Then, if you explain it that way, mm-hmm. I think that's great. So, who is your favorite artist? 
Oh, you mean from like? No, anywhere. 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 Okay. You mean from the like, that's all? <laughs> <laughs> Not me. Eh? I, I don't really have favorite artists to be honest. Okay. Like, I, I just listen to to all these genres. So that's all. Good music okay. is good music. Yeah, good music is good music. Yeah. You know, like uh, I mean, uh, um, what you made a very like smart move there, lah, like colliding your yes, patient with yes. your academic field. So would you like you know there are many pressure there are pressure students mm. during the college yes, yes. and like um the tenth and the, the eleventh and the twelfth students mm-hmm. who are yet to like go for and pursue their PhD degree. Yes, yes. How like what would you? Tell them like how would you tell them how to survive in BSW? What they can expect the scope and you know the aims of BSW. Yes. Well, uh, if I would encourage you guys, if you are an active social, uh, socially active person in society, in churches, or maybe in your uh, uh, schools and colleges, but I would really encourage you to consider BSW because it's a really um, broad subject vast subject and it's very interesting subject and it does not only f- uh, like I said mentioned earlier again and again it's not only f- f- uh, focuses on like a specific field but also sp- focuses on various fields be it science be it social uh, be it society be it uh, human anatomy so mm, yeah I would like I would really encourage you guys to take up bits of you and one thing uh, regarding your career as well uh, there there's lot there there are many uh, institutions mm. I would say they are looking for social workers yes. who who have a degree in MA, uh, mm. MA I mean MSW so they look out for MSW students uh, MSW graduates because they have uh, the experience level is not only a specific field but mm. like different fields so okay. we have that plus point in that so uh, we get easily uh, employed in uh, those institutions that are looking for MSW students that's great i was just mm-hmm. thinking you know like it's not about uh, i mean it is about bsw but what do you think about the college uh, giving you the opportunity to uh, have practical experiences you know field work every friday I think that is something so different, right? Mm. Yes, yes. Well, for me, it's really eye-opening, to be honest. Because yeah. I've not heard about any colleges that's been providing such opportunities. Yes. Right? So, for me, personally, really thankful to the Tetsuo College mm. for providing us this opportunity. Yeah. Uh, is there any, you know, like, uh, a social media page or platform where we can keep updated with the Department. Yes, yes. We have, we do have a, uh, an Instagram page. It's okay. uh, it's it's BSW, that's a college. Okay, we'll go. We'll, we'll see. We'll check it out. Yeah. Yeah, we'll check it out later. I will make sure that it's in the description, so you know the viewers can check it out. Yeah. yeah. It was so nice having you here. I, I we I again uh, personally I think I get a lot of in. Uh, I was, I went to so many insightful things. You know having you here and I'm so grateful I was part of one of the hosts. Yeah. Yes, uh, thank you so much Dean for being here because you know like personally I was very interested about social work. Even me. I just wanted to like get a personal experience as a clarification. Yeah. Yeah. We're, we are very thankful and uh, we are very grateful to have you here as well. Thank you yeah. for agreeing to be our guest. You know, so. And we'll try to make sure that like we we'll give you more visuals of doing performing and performance. <laughs> Maybe you know him doing the musical and then having let's a see, let's see about that. Stress. <laughs> <laughs> you know, just just stay tuned. Just stay tuned. Yeah, yeah, and you'll see it if you subscribe to our channel, like and comment. Yeah. So. Yes. And you're gonna see so many uh interesting people like me in the upcoming episodes. So stay tuned. I don't know if I'm very much interesting, but <laughs> 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 I have to say this. <laughs> but no, thank you so much for your time. Yeah, thank, thank you so much for your time. It was really insightful, right? Yes, it was like it I was so good. Yeah, like, even me, I gained so many knowledge about your department. Yes. So it was so nice, so, and I so am much. sure the viewers uh, will, will also agree you know, because uh, just the real time about social work, uh, it is what it is, but. I hope this clarifies your yeah. curiosity. So yeah, thank you. Bye for you. Bye.